What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Batman The Telltale Series video here on the channel. In this one we're going to be doing the final chapter of Season 1. But that's not to say that I won't be doing Season 2 because I'm very, very, very much going to be doing Season 2. Seeing as I've been thoroughly enjoying this game from start to finish essentially. Of course I do think that it started off really strong and then it kind of plateaued a little bit. Uh, it, it kind of got like... Just kind of same old, same old or random stuff, but it's not to say it in a negative way. It was just kind of the same stuff over again. But I did like it. It was just kind of like whatever. You know what I mean? There was not enough to be like, wow, it outdid itself. But that's not to say it in a bad way or a negative way or whatever because it's still very good in my opinion. And it does get me very excited to do to do this final chapter and, of course, starting Season 2 as well. So... If you're excited for that though, do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So let's go ahead and get started. Previously on Batman the Telltale series. <laughs> it's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad help bump up her parents. Why would my father have the veils killed? He said he killed the Vales. She was born in Arkham. Victoria Arkham. So where are you gonna go? I got some other business I need to take care of. What the hell did you do? Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. That's what a leader does. Ah, ah, oh, you psycho! Uh, you can do whatever you want to me. Lady Arkham's brains are already in motion. Dun dun dun. Alrighty. It's going to be very interesting to find out what the hell is going to happen for this season one finale because it's pretty, it's been pretty intense, man. I'm not going to lie with everything that's been going on with between Bruce and Batman. I feel like we're fighting a war on the two separate sides. The city is still reeling from an explosion Mayor Harvey Dent set off that obliterated an entire city block and killed innocents. When questioned about his extreme measures, Mayor Dent said he'll use any force necessary to take down the children of Arkham. Run, Gordon! Give up your badge and we'll let you live. Meanwhile, his uh -oh. opponents are routinely silenced. The latest to speak out is Police Commissioner Grogan. He called Dent a murderer and a terrorist. And demanded his immediate resignation. Oh snap! In response, Dent's enforcers attempted to arrest Grogan, sparking violence inside the precinct. These are dark days in Gotham. Our mayor promised us a better city, but delivers only more violence. How long do we let this two-faced stay in power? How long can we? Oh snap! You can't be in here. Hey, can't do this. Shut up. Go. Oh, no snap. Batman to the rescue. To the precinct door by order of City Hall. Just try me. You punks. Oh, God. Let's go. Ow. That didn't even look like it hurt him. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, snap. I didn't... No. That was close. I almost messed that up pretty bad. Got him. I don't know why I'm nervous Just right now. Time, Batman. Ugh. Mayor Dent's lost his goddamn mind. His enforcers have overrun the city. Apparently, our new mayor doesn't care much for dissent. He's ordered a purge of every honest cop we have left. I'll take care of him. He's a maniac. 
and he needs to be stopped before he tears this city apart. Yeah, don't let me get in your way. Hell yeah. Come on. The commissioner's still down there. Oh. Dude, it's the GCPD in war with a private paramilitary group. I have to be. Oh my god, oh my dude. Lead. Let's go! Ow! You know that would kill him. Oh! Ow! What's up, buddy? That's all you got? Oh! My god! The lobby. The commissioner. They can't hold out much longer. Gordon blasted him in the face with a shotgun. I'm surprised he still had a head. Oh no. Oh snap, this one was weird. Yeah, I'm not a bad guy, am I? Got him. Oh. Oh, it's party time. You guys say good night. Dunskis. Oh, it took out two of them. Ah! Uh, ow! Dude, Batman is so brutal in this game. It's fantastic. What's up, homeboy? Oh! Ow! I'm pretty sure that snapped his neck. Good job, Commissioner. Oh! Oh my god, dude, the commissioner's dead. Uh, let's go. Ow. I can't believe the commissioner got shot, dude, but I guess Gordon has to get promoted somehow. The commissioner. Fuck. Yes, he's dead. Damn it! No. Not you two. Uh. He gave his life for he Gotham. Died a hero, giving his life for Gotham. I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Now this. This is not your fault. It's a bastard, Dents. Krogan's Damn, a good dude. Man. I'm a family man. He hated me, though. Lieutenant Gordon. Gordon, come in. S Sergeant Kelly. Report. It's the mayor. And Wayne Manor. He's oh, God. Hostages. And he's killing them one by one until Bruce Wayne shows. He says, he says, cops show up, he'll kill another. Batman shows up, he'll kill them all. Kelly, get out of Sir, it. Sir, I'm. I'll let the coin decide. Kelly. Oh, God. Damn it. Get yourself to a hospital, Lieutenant. Oh, we got a very tough situation here. Like, what do we do? Alfred, are you safe? Yes, I barricaded in the Batcave. I heard gunshots, but then Harvey's men disabled the cameras. I have to face Harvey as Bruce Wayne. Otherwise, he'll just keep killing people. Perhaps going as Bruce could be an advantage. Even without the suit, you're a formidable um. opponent. I'll get close to disarm him. I should be able to keep Harvey talking long enough to get close. Then I'll make my move. It may be your best chance. I'll Maybe. be standing by if you need me. It's time to end this, Harvey. Once and for all. Dude, I... One year ago... I want a safer Gotham. A Gotham where working people can raise their families. No fear of being robbed or stabbed or, or worse. I just... I know I can make the city better. If only I could... Okay, I'll back you. <laughs> Come on, Bruce. That joke is in poor taste. <laughs> I'm serious, Harvey. I'll fund your campaign completely. Completely? I've lived in Gotham my whole life. And I've never seen an official I can believe. Tell you. 
Ah. Thank you, Bruce. I, I, I promise I will not let you down. Mm -mm, never even crossed my mind. The only real question is this election or next. We'll let the coin decide. Oh snap! Oh God! <laughs> Lucky, but someone has to die. Volunteering to Oh run. no Harvey Wayne About damn time Oh my god I'm nervous for these people I know I'm gonna put them in harm's way They're already Sounds in harm's way two of them. Get the drones online I'll see what I can do I wasn't sure you'd come You weaseled your way out of the death you deserve Um like a coward I've come to help you Harvey you actually grow a backbone I came to help my friend, Harvey. I don't want your help. I want you dead! That is the sickness talking. And I know you're in there somewhere, Harvey. <laughs> Wait. Remember all the I good times. I've tried to fight it, Bruce, but I can't. Bruce, I only ever wanted to help Gotham. We know. And now look at me. I can't stop him. He's stronger than I am. Stop whining! There's oh crap, did something happen? I looked away me. for a second. This city needs to be purged of people like you! Oh god, I messed this up, didn't I? Oh no. Traitors. Terrorists. I should not have looked away. Harvey, don't! This is the only way to clean up this cesspool! Oh no. Oh no, 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 dude. Oh my god. I so regret looking no, away. Please. Oh my god, my heart's broken. This is what happens to people who cross me. Uh, you said you wanted to save for Gotham. You were the fiercest DA the city ever had. Someone who fought for people's dreams. So much for a safer Gotham. Oh, You're snap. Right. This isn't me. Go. Go. Get away. I would let them all go, but... It's not up to me. What the hell is that? Oh, Deborah, God. My not-so-faithful assistant. You oh, no. My enemies in both since the start. <laughs> I swear I did all you want, but it's not up to me. His life, even my uh, you know this is wrong. You have always known right from wrong. I am begging you. Oh God, what did I do? What, oh my what God, did dude. Make me do? Now, Bruce. Oh this no. Is the only way to keep people in line. Uh Kill me instead. Harvey, please. You called me here for a reason. Take me! You you were Harvey's friend, Wayne. He thought you'd save this city together. Oh but god. He, he was a fool for believing in you! No! Let's go! That's enough, Harvey. You're... You're right. Oh, God. Two-faced move, I know. But sometimes, you have to make your own luck. One last call. A bullet in the head, or one in the heart. He has pink eye. Look I'm at him. I'm feeling pretty good about those odds. You're a dirty SOB, Harvey. I just made my own luck. Give me the coin. Nope. I need... I need the result. Where do I shoot? Drop the damn coin! Without the uh, coin, I can't. 
I don't know what you're pa doing. Pocket the coin. I don't think so. He's obsessed with that coin. Uh, Woo! Bruce, I don't, I don't know what to do. I can't decide. It's too much. Oh, it's too much. It's too much. I can't. <laughs> A safer Gotham, Harvey. Oh my Just God, like dude. You I feel so bad for him. What's going on? Wherever they put me, whatever they do, I'll get out. I'm coming for you, Wayne. Sure you will. Nowhere is safe. I'll get you You're help, Harvey. You're gonna die. I'm gonna get you help, Harvey. We will get you better. I am better, Wayne. I'm the best I've ever been. He's really lost it. Oh, you'll see. <laughs> I'm not done yet. I legitimately feel bad for him. I feel partially responsible for creating him. What's this? Put a dent in crime. Stop. Elect Harvey Dent for Mayor of Gotham. I, I owe you so much. You're a hero. And I'm gonna make sure all of Gotham knows it. Yay! You should be rotting in Arkham! Oh! Oh, snap! God damn. That dude got blasted. Lady Arkham hasn't forgotten you. Everything you love will burn. Lady Arkham is a meanie. Damn, dude, was that seriously just the intro? I think that was just the intro. Alright, what do we got here? Your usual tea, and the entire pantry, I'm afraid, didn't survive the fire. This is from my own personal supply. Thanks, Alfred. We're not the only ones that took a hit while Mayor Dent was in power. Well, at least you've ensured Harvey won't be hurting anyone else. Good. Bruce. These last few weeks, I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing what do you mean? off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. Yeah, but good not point. Just the physical toll. Psychological. Those were men you once trusted. And after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Always letting you down. Uh, I have you, Alfred. I'm not all people. You've never disappointed me, Alfred. But I have. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it if I'd done something all those years ago. This, this is my fault. All of it. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted that. Wanted to put an end to his crimes. If I'd helped her, if I'd stopped Thomas. No, that's crazy. None of these horrors would have occurred. Uh, Lady Arkham. All that matters fixing it. fault it is doesn't matter, Alfred. What does is that we stop them. All right, sir. The children of Arkham are still out there, and Lady Arkham. With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the only remaining piece. Good. We need to figure out her next move. I still can't believe it's, uh... The only thing we do uh... is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. Whatever her name is, I already forgot her name. CEO access restored, and finally log into Wayne Enterprises, and see exactly what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. So it looks like I'm on Last top already. With all the data we have on Vicky Vale. Vicky. We might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. 
uh, determine the link between Oswald, Cobblepot, and Vicky Vale. Uh, let's see Your this. Your administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Good. Let's see what About Oswald time. was doing while he sat in my chair. Master Cobblepot's sense of humor <laughs> hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just see what he was doing? Sure, why not? All right, let me see here. So, surveillance. Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is that any different than the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered? It's not. Unless... Hold on. Huh. Security? Um... What do we have here? They did more than just look at these schematics. Every building in Gotham with a Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. If Oswald That's not was good. Braun, Vicky is the brains. So let's check her file. She may have left clues about what she was using Oswald's access for. I want to, but I want to see the rest of this. Uh, real estate? Oswald was, <laughs> was trying to buy an island. What on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's assets and likeness to brand the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. Let me guess, a snowy it's paradise? Call it Falcone Island. What the fuck? That's, ra that's random. Hmm. We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Yeah, we will, but of once course. I see the rest of these files... So you hold your horses, Bruce. Financial reports. Oh. Oswald certainly wasn't very frugal with my money. You have a few yachts to return, it appears. <laughs> so it explains how the children of Arkham had a seemingly endless supply of guns. Oswald was using Wayne money to arm them. Doesn't surprise me, actually. All right, records. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne network. Um, Bruce. Oswald manipulated my records as well. It would appear your degree was in sociology. <laughs> and medical records. There are some well, but colorful diseases. Ah, so apparently I have STDs now. To fix. Ah. Oh, that's better. All right, Oswald Compot. No surprise here. Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. He was enrolled at Cambridge. <laughs> <laughs> Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. All right, Victoria. There it is, the link. V Vicky Vale. All mention of her birth name, Victoria Arkham, is completely gone. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? He also erased something from Vicky's research at the Gazette. I can't tell what was removed from here, but Wayne Tech leaves a trace when it alters data. One the bat computer can decode. Nice. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? I don't know. Alright, so let's go back and now we'll check Arkham's Lady Arkham's file. Wait, why Vicky am Vale, I getting up? Mid-30s reported for the Gotham Gazette. And not in the public record. Her true name. Victoria Arkham. To think she was here in the manor. She gave nothing away of her true nature then. That's crazy. All right, let me see. Uh, we'll start from top to bottom. Look at. Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not unlike Batman. I just need to find her. Yeah, but the end game for both is in a completely different situation. Uh, there's Symbol, uh, Children of Arkham. The Children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to get justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. That kind of explains why uh, Joker knew about, the, about her. Vicky Vale Gazette. The Gazette's records are the articles written by Vicky Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries. But yet, it doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. 
So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy to alter. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. So, wait. Let me unlock it now. Now we know how Oswald manipulated Vicky's records, the back computer should be able to... There. No more holes. So what is it? Uh, Vicky... Patient files? She was looking into Arkham patients. Reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Yeah, that's not good at all. Uh, Wayne Tech. Vicky was digging deep. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy forums. All to find. It's a list. Got the buildings that use Wayne Tech security systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. It's almost every landmark in the city. We're on to something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside Wayne Enterprises, she can't unlock that door remotely. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Dun dun dun. Speaking of, is it is that her? No, it's one of Lucius's prototypes on the move. What? But Lucius locked everything away. Well, he needed a better lock. Wait a minute. <sighs> oh, it's she stole from you, Catwoman. After we opened our doors to her, after all that you two, Alfred, <laughs> I know Bruce, but. <laughs> Why would she do this? It's Cat. I mean, it's Selena. She's cold-hearted. Uh, that she must selfish. have a reason. She must have her reasons. Well, but yes, so she, she is does. selfish. Computer visual. The prototype she stole. It's an electronic skeleton key. With it, you could bypass any security system made by Wayne Tech. That key is far too dangerous in Miss Kyle's hands, especially with Lady Arkham still at large. That's true. Get the car ready, Alfred. And Alfred, let Lucius know what's happened. I'm going to get can some answers from Selena. Can Lucius turn it off? Wayne one. That's his license plate. Wayne one. Selena's gonna be uh, curious to find out how we know. <laughs> hey, Bruce. I wasn't expecting you. Thought uh, I'd make it outside the city limits, at least. Uh, don't look surprised. Trip. You should know by now not to underestimate me. I thought you might be busy with, I don't know, saving the world. I'm flattered. Kind of. So highly. But I know you're not here for me, are you? I don't blame you for wanting it back. I'm surprised you had a toy like this. How does no she know what Batman it is, though? Would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more exciting. Why should I give it back? Um, so much potential. Just imagine what uh, I could put It's to too dangerous. Claws into. That device is far too dangerous to be out in the world. If Lady Arkham got a hold of it. That blood would be on your hands. Wow, that's pretty dramatic, Bruce. That's an understatement, though. That could hack into anything that Catch. Wayne Tech. Thank you. You might be exaggerating, but I'd rather not take the chance. Aw, she does <laughs> like us. Oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor and guy me. just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. 
<laughs> the oh, she great did Bruce use us. Wayne. Not surprised there. Imagine my surprise when the rich playboy turned out to be Batman, scourge of Gotham. Uh, I don't I believe you. I was always going to steal from Bruce Wayne. I just never expected he'd be so interesting. You talk a good game, but I don't buy it for a second. <laughs> Let's see. Shallow. Well, kind you of. You really think you know me that well? I know that whatever this started as, that's not all it means to you now. The only thing it means is that I'm very good at my job. This is also true. I'm getting out of here while the getting's good. Gotham's a house on fire, and I'm not gonna burn with it. If you were smart, you'd get out of here too. Or this you could stand outside and put out the fire. It's your entire family. Just leave it all behind. Do something more meaningful with those skills of yours. Nah. You don't need the money, but Gotham needs me. Fun. Gotham needs me. And I won't abandon the people of this city, no matter how they feel about me. After the way they've treated you. Yep. You've got one hell of a thick skin. You're gonna need it. Good. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After Aww. all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. Uh, I'm bound to break some. You wouldn't go that far. You and I may disagree on a lot of things, but I'm not worried about you. You're that sure? Yep. Bruce, I, I think I finally get what this is all about. You're upset that I'm leaving. Uh, kind of. What'd you think? That one night of sex meant we were going steady. Is not that really. What you really thought? Uh, I had fun, didn't you? Uh, well, maybe oh crap! I pushed the wrong button. What happened between us meant something to me. Oh, Bruce, didn't know you were the sensitive type. Just stop the show, Selena. Stop pretending nothing matters. <sighs> Look, Bruce, I'll admit that what you and I had, it wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. Aw. Intriguing job than I was expecting. <laughs> still a job and that job's done I'm done with you it's not complicated I'm not a good person I'm certainly no hero and I don't want to be I'm a thief that's all I am dun, dun, dun. I told you that from the start I never pretended you know that's not true stop it's not true I know that there's more to you you're just afraid to admit it. You'd like it if that were true, wouldn't you? Partially. Why would you even think that? Because it is true. I've made my feelings pretty clear. Uh, you saved my life. Listening. You saved my life. You could have left me to die back in that warehouse, but you didn't. Someone who's only out for herself, who's just a thief, wouldn't do that. Oh yeah? Who would? You! A good, a good person. person. I knew it! That's Woo! A hero. You know, after I found out you were Batman, I thought nothing else could surprise me. But you just keep on surprising me. Oh, snap. Kiss her goodbye. Aww. Something to remember me by. <laughs> I won't need any help remembering you. Good. Well... It's been fun. Aww. It sucks that they would never be able to be a thing. Uh, stay out of trouble. You stay out of trouble. Because if I catch you taking what's not yours again, I'll have to stop you. <laughs> I look forward to our next dance. They're adorable, man. I really wish they could work. There's no way they would Lucius, be able I've to. Got the key. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! Oh, she, shit! Uh, I, I tried to keep them out, but... Alfred? Oh, Alfred. snap! Oh, no. Oh, no. That's not good. Alfred!
Damn, they really broke in. Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. Just tell me how I can help. Get over here as fast as you can. I'm on my way. We're gonna find him, Bruce. I know. Why didn't he go to the Batcave? Need to focus. Figure out what happened here. What happened to you, Al? Detective mode. All right, we'll start close. Scuff mark. That looks like a like a burn a mark. Scuff mark. What could have caused this? Fire. Uh, furniture. I say the fire of the chimney. Furniture scattered outwards from a single point. Possibly an explosion? Fireplace? Ash everywhere. Alright, let me uh, look at everything first. What did they do to you, Alfred? Maybe that's Alfred that did the damage. Broken shelf. Something big was thrown against this wall. Or someone. I... I hope they didn't do this to Alfred, man. That'd be fucked up. He's an old man. Face was knocked over in the struggle. The fight left nothing untouched. There's a real freaking thing. Pull cue. This pull cue was used as a weapon. That Swung explains so the blood. Hard it broke in half. All right. Well, I'm pretty sure that's gonna attach to the blood. Blood splatter. More blood are here. Blood pattern looks like it came off a high velocity hit. Um, door. The lock's been completely destroyed. Alfred must have barricaded himself in here. But they got in anyway. All right, time to put everything. Wait, hold on. Fire, fire poker. Why would that be? Oh, it's because it's stuck against the wall. How the hell? All right, time to put things together. Let's see if we can put this with that. Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. But it was knocked away. Okay, it was deflected. All right, so let's go ahead and... Oh, we can't, we can't turn it off or take it off? No, I guess that's the only thing we can. All right, so scuff mark. Now let's look at the pull cue and connect it to this. Alfred used the pull cue as a weapon. Broke it across his attacker's head. When that didn't stop him, he used the jagged end to stab, spraying blood across the pool table. He's a he did a pretty decent job defending himself. Uh, maybe the these two, I don't think so, but worth a try, I guess. Lady Arkham must have used the concussion blast from her staff to try and stop Alfred. That's almost, that almost doesn't make sense from the angle, you know? I know what happened. The children of Arkham broke in. Alfred barricaded himself inside the parlor. He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. He broke it across one of their heads, then stabbed him to get away. Another assailant tackled Alfred, knocking over the vase. Alfred almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor used her staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself. Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack, causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. Oh no. He smashed his face into it. Oh no. doesn't belong there. Maybe he's trying to tell us something. Lady Arkham wanted me to find this. Does he does he know? Does she know that I'm Batman? Alfred. What does that say? The butler did it. 
password reckoning. What? You have no idea. The butler did it? I'm confused. to keep a cool head lucius worrying isn't going to help alfred we need to focus you're right let's get started how are we going to find him and how does she get her staff to go through classes. alfred like that the reflection he's making sure i see the reflection in his glasses <laughs> he knows the back computer can use multiple reflection angles to recreate the room that he's in and I can view the virtual image using my cow. He's a genius. Good thinking, Alfred. He's potentially smarter than us. Cow VR? Okay, Lucius. Woo. Freeze frame on the first signal Alfred gives. Paint us a picture. Let's Here do we this. Go. All right, let's, uh, children of Arkham. Must be one of the thugs Alfred fought upstairs. Uh, camera? Professional grade camera. Probably came from the Gazette's office. How could we get this clear of a picture from his reflections? Stairs leading up, cement walls. We're in a basement. Alfred's trying to look at things that might give us a clue to where he's being held. Okay, looks like we've seen all there is to see in this frame. Let's move on to Alfred's next signal. You got it. Where could he be, though? This doesn't tell us anything. Uh, boxes. Doesn't seem to be anything else here. Let's keep looking. Oh, uh, what's this? Water heater? Rogers Plumbing. A service company for the water heater. I can use their records to find home addresses for their clients. We're getting closer. Yeah, but we're not there yet. Nothing else to see here. Moving on. Next frame. Uh, Mason stamp? A Mason stamp. Only one Masonic Lodge in the city. Gotham City Fraternal Order of Stonemasons. So the house was built in 1945 by them. That's a big lead. Pretty damn big, Lady Arkham. Lady Arkham. Keep searching. Jump to Alfred's next signal. You got it. This should be the last one, right? Maybe? What's this? Window. A basement window. What's that outside? No standing bus stop. It's a bus stop. They're by a bus stop. There we go. Oh, we know okay. exactly where they're we at now. to pinpoint a location. Well, let's hope. We should definitely have enough. Um, let's see. Let's know we're down by bus stop since we know where every one of them are. This, but no stop number. This will help pinpoint the neighborhood. Agreed. All right, so now the building year. Filtering for all homes built on that date. And then, out of those homes, let's check which ones have basements. And then lastly, we could just use the repair logs. These are all the homes serviced by this water heater company on the days and months listed. So we narrowed it down to three, I'm assuming? You are not going to believe this. What is it? Lady Arkham is back at the Vale House. I Where had a feeling her foster parents. According to its records, it has a basement. Well, just in case she's expecting you. Oh, what am I getting? Ooh, a new bat suit. What is that? Something I almost didn't get to finish because of pain. It's the most advanced version yet. <laughs> Lady Arkham will have no idea what I've got of these sleeves. That is sick. Batsuit Mark II. Well done, Let's do Jesus. this. You've been long overdue for an upgrade. I'm so down. This suit is beyond state of the art. <laughs> oh god, dude. We are oh dude, it's it's on. It's on this like Donkey Kong. Tonight. 
Yes, it does, Bruce. I mean, Batman. Vale Residence. 8.38 p.m. That's it. There's a, there's a yellow tape. I can't come in. Game's over. Heading into the basement. Be careful. Oh, I'm supposed to walk. <laughs> I'm just standing here like nothing. Oh, come on. I pushed A. That was dumb. Now I gotta do this again. You can see the freaking hole right there. I pushed A. That's bogus. Heading into the basement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know, Bruce. Be we careful. know. Come on, you're gonna move or not? What? There we go. And go, 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 go. Damn. I'm all right. He just jumped up like crazy, dude. He's got great reflexes. There we are. There's no one here. That Whoa. suit looks badass. Damn it. There's blood on the walls. I'm going to see what I can find. Standing by. It's a lot of detective work. Blood splatter. Alfred's blood is still fresh. Means we can't be far behind them. Okay. The chair he was sitting in? This is where they had Alfred. Where they beat him. Damn, Bruce is pissed. Uh, blood trail. Wait a minute. Yeah, my tripliners are going into the wall. And why is there a footstep? Alfred, there's a boot print in the blood. Lady Arkham's soldiers dragged him. The trail stops at the wall. Actually, it goes under it. Yeah, it's, there's no something back there. More to this basement than it would appear. Taking a closer look. All right. Uh. Look at the wall is just a facade. Why would the veils have a false wall in their basement? Uh, let's push. Now let's find out where the veils were hiding. There's a small room. Damn, dude, this is pretty sophisticated. With a hole in the floor. Wait, let's look at this real quick. A rope ladder. Anyone down there would be trapped. So this is where they have him. Call out? Alfred! Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Just to be safe. Let's open it. There's nobody even in here. I'm going inside. I don't think that's a smart idea. What in the world is this? What the hell? Bruce, what's down there? Do you see Alfred? No. It's some kind of torture chamber. Shackles, belts, blood. What? This is terrible. Vicky. She, she was, was a victim. Locked away. Who could do that to their child? I'm beginning to understand. What is there to understand? Uh. To willfully hurt a child. It's where her anger comes no from. I wonder Vicky is consumed with hate. It's all she's ever known. I can't even imagine. But it doesn't give her the right to take it out on others. I agree. Bale's foster children may not have been the only ones to suffer here. I followed Alfred's blood into this hole. If he had any opportunity at all, he would have left me a clue. Uh, let's look at the drawings. What are drawings? Vicky must have drawn them when she was a prisoner. The chalk here is different. Newer. Maybe there's been multiple kids down here. Um. Bloody scratches. Right here. Fingernails. 
Someone tried to climb out. Oh, that's so Alfred. terrible. My god, dude. No. Uh, the doll. Oh, that Stop. fucking thing is creepy. Vicky created her here, in this room. This is where Vicky Vale became Lady Arkham. Dun dun dun. Looks like a mummy. Belts. The belt. It's caked in blood. So bad. Uh, shackles. shackles. Blood on them. Old. And new. Vicky did to Alfred what was done to her. Fresh blood. This has to be Alfred's. Alfred laid down here. Is there anything else down here? Uh, yes. Alfred's glasses and... Chuck! One piece apart from the others. Blue. Yeah. Same color as my tech. Can't be a coincidence. Maybe... What does that say? Uh, look Fingers. this. Fleeing from something. Is that... Arkham Asylum. They're trying to free the prisoners? What about over here? Some of the words have been highlighted. She will liberate. Um. She will liberate Arkham Asylum. Dun dun dun. This is what he wanted me to find. To see. The newest chalk. He's added to an old drawing of Arkham Asylum. He drew figures outside the gates. Like they're running away. The words highlighted are she will and liberate. She will liberate. I don't see what that has to do with Alfred. Alfred's just along for the ride. She's been using Wayne Enterprises to get access to the buildings with Wayne Tech security systems. Damn. Including Arkham Asylum. She's going to open the doors. Duh. Release the inmates. I thought it was and obvious, she took Bruce. Alfred with her. Call Gordon to the GCPD. I'm on it. Lady Arkham will be expecting us. We'll catch her by surprise. Bet you there's a camera in there. No? Alright. Well, I guess I was wrong. Dun dun dun. Hey, it's Sock Puppet Man. They, look, they sound like zombies. Literally. Good. Orderlies are rounded up. That's the last of it, then. The children of Arkham have taken over. That suits no slouch. You're well prepared for a fight. Good. The GCPD are on their way to deal with the inmates. If you can find Alfred, maybe you can get him out of there before all hell breaks loose. Almost ready. Let her know. Oh, got snap. On our way. Go ahead. I got this. What if the... Is the Joker going to help us? Probably not. Because we didn't help him. Let's go. Oh, it's on. This ends now, Vicky. Tell me where Alfred Pennyworth is. The butler. Bruce Wayne has a bat on his people. Answer the question. Uh oh. Where he is doesn't matter. He'll be dead soon. Another uh, corpse in Bruce Wayne's family. No one's dying tonight. No one's dying tonight. You really think you're in control here? Yeah, I do actually. <laughs> Your confidence is impressive. She sounds like a man. Save the butler. Or the rest of Gotham. A lesson needs to be taught. They won't look the other way. Not again. And when did Gotham look away from you? Don't try to psychoanalyze me, Batman. You have no idea what I've done to come this far. 
Uh, I kind of do. Too much to turn back now. Uh, I know you experience pain. I know pain. you've suffered. You were tortured, held captive by the people who were supposed to love you. I don't know how you survived. You wouldn't know how I survived. I survived. Because every night, I dreamed of the revenge I'd take on them. And this forsaken city. Uh oh. Let's go. What the hell? Oh snap. Well, there is something. You underestimate the true children of Arkham. These souls kept behind the bars. Open the doors. Oh no. Showdown at the assault at the asylum. Listen to me. Freedom is yours. The only one standing in your way is Batman. Is Batman. Batman. He's stuck me in here. Me too. Oh god. He's the crazy one. Oh god. Let's go. That was easy. Damn, dude, Ali ooped his ass. Oh, they're beating up the orderlies. Let's go. Just beat up the wolf man. Ali oop. Batman. The entire security system's offline. Every inmate's loose. The leader of the children of Arkham. Did you see her? They went. That was fast. <laughs> He's gone. Oh snap! It's getting real! What's going on? I have a slow mo mode? Let's go! So we're gonna hit him with the face with a freaking dinner plate. That's one. Let's go. We're gonna toss him in the kitchen. Uh, let's sit him on this chair. Dunsky, steel chair to ass, dude. Good old WWE. Taser to this. 50,000 volts. Right to the carotid artery. And then Arkham to this. Now let's see how this plays out. Let's go. Ow. Goodbye, buddy. Oh, shit. That hurt. Let's go. Steel chair. Stone Cold Steve Austin, baby. Ooh. Come on. Did it work? You know, she is good. Come on, baby. Oh! That was a hard hit. Wait. Take your time, sons. That's the plan. You shouldn't have taken your time. You should have just off me right then and there. Because now you're screwed. Nice try. I actually pushed the wrong button at first. Oh, it's the Joker again. Inspiring. Such a pleasure to see your work in person.
<laughs> the Joker is absolutely insane. Oh! <laughs> Lady Arkham is lost. We've got the inmates. Lock it down. Damn, dude, this is crazy. Oh, I remember you. He's cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs now. There's that doesn't no even look out. like her anymore. There's always another way here, Batman. All the people that Thomas Wayne condemned to this place unwillingly, they speak through the walls. Their ghosts walk. They know the way. I can't help those people now, <clears throat> but I can help Alfred Pennyworth. Take me to him. My pleasure. Dun dun dun. Wait, where the hell are we going? Is this the location of the final showdown? What? She can fly? What just happened? Where'd she go? But she can fly, so that's interesting. Very interesting indeed. Oh god, I can hear Alfred. Uh... Show yourself. Vicky, show yourself. <laughs> what the hell happened to me? Probably broke a rib on the Let him drop. Go. The butler has to die. Payment for Thomas Wayne's sins. He took away my family, so I'll take away his sons. Oh snap. If you really want to save the butler. Bring me Bruce Wayne. Don't tell me I'm gonna have to. It's you. He's probably cowering behind us. Let him go first. And a hundred bodyguards right now. I'll bring you Wayne. But first, let Alfred Pennyworth go. No, no, no. Afraid he's too useful to do that just yet. Oh, snap. Have She's you not so dumb. For one old man? She's gonna know. I'm not just a nor ordinary man. Oh, snap! Dude, that was close. Although I would have liked to see that death scene. <laughs> this isn't a game to me. You know, Batman, I really don't understand. Why are you fighting me? What, you think we're on the same side? Falcone and Hill deserved to die. If anything, I did you a favor. We're fighting the same fight, Batman. Can you see that? Um. We want the same things. I'm nothing like you. We are nothing alike, Vicky. I fight to save lives. You're a cold-blooded killer. Facts. You shouldn't be here. You shouldn't be defending him. You think Bruce Wayne is any better than Superman? He hides. Behind his status and wealth. So? He's a coward. Blaming other men to carry his burdens. You aren't my enemy. What's that sound? Oh, snap! What are we in? In an, in an uncharted game? What the hell's going on? Oh, snap. There she is. I'm curious, Batman. I know why I wear the mask. It's who I am. Who I was always meant to be. What Is it? about you? Do you wear the mask to hide? No, the, the sun bothers me. Really I'm sensitive. Are you the man or the mask? Uh, a symbol. The mask is a symbol. Some fear it. But for others, it brings hope. When I first saw it, I found it inspiring. Oh, snap. And once you're dead, I'm going to mount that mask on my wall. But first, I'll see the man beneath. Uh, I don't think you will. Oh! She's gonna unmask me, is she? she... Oh, God. Where'd she go? She just keeps disappearing on us. 
take me to church. Hey, it's Alfred. Hold on, Alfred. Uh, you, you, you came, you came for me. Oh God, what's going on? After what you said, I knew you'd come. The man, the man I, I made you. Just hold on, Alfred. Did you see where she went? Uh, she just dis disappeared. I'm getting you out of here. Above you. Oh no. Oh. Interesting how you speak to him. Yeah, so she's gonna figure this out. Alfred. Such concern for someone you've never met before. It's called compassion. It's called compassion, Biggie. Something you seem to know very little about. Sounds like deflection to me. There's more. <laughs> well, she's right. Telling. It makes me wonder. Do you really care? Only oh, one no. way to find out. Oh. That man. Don't you. Shut up, old man. You've seen my true self. Oh, God. Your turn. Prove that you can. Take off your mask. Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! See the man you really are. Oh God! 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 Oh fuck it! That's what it will take to save him. No! I can't believe I just did that. This must be some kind of trick. Bruce Wayne, he, he'd never be the man that is. He only looks out for himself. Oh, this is gonna drive her insane. Now I understand. As Batman, you can prey upon the weak, the defenseless, just like your father did. A true Wayne. <laughs> There's nothing heroic about you. Uh, I, you're right about my father. Naive socialite, you can sweet talk. I know a liar when I see one. Oh, my God. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Ow. She's good. No more lies. No more talk. The only truth left is in your death. Come on, let's go. Come on, Bruce. Let's go. Punch her in the chest, in the throat. Let's go. Oh. She'll marry me? No, I'm good, bro. Let's go. She is hardcore. I'll give her that much. Come on. Break the damn thing. Come on. She's gonna end up killing herself. Let's go, Bruce. Let's go. Whoa, let's go. Oh my god. Oh no. Stop, Vicky. It's over. She's gonna kill herself. I'm not gonna choose her over Alfred. That much is for damn sure. So if that's an option, Vicky's screwed. Let's go! Come on! 
Man, this battle is intense. Come on. Oh, snap. Oh! Damn! We're really going at it, aren't we? Come on! Oh! That looked painful. Extremely painful. Come on, baby! Oh snap. Oh snap. She's not even done yet either. You belong in this place, Bruce. Lost. Forgotten. Buried. And Gotham will not mourn. Ooh, I'm gonna use her own tools against her. Let's go! That was dope. That was dope. Come on, we gotta save Alfred, Bruce. Bruce. Oh no. I see your true face. I'll never trust you. Oh, she's trapped. Oh my god. Yeah, she's dead. At least I didn't have to choose, because I would have chose Alfred all day long. That battle was intense. A week later. Very After nice. last week's events at Arkham Asylum, a spokesperson for the GCPD assured us that the breakout has been contained and all inmates have been returned to their cells. Miss Vale is missing and presumed dead following a gruesome battle with the caped vigilante known only as the Batman. Hell yeah. Her death marks the end of Children of Arkham's reign of terror. Lucius. <sighs> If the public knew the half of it, it's better that they don't. Uh, this came in the mail. It's unsigned. I bet you it's from Catwoman. Yep, I knew Selena. it. Selena. With everything that's been going on, I... I haven't gotten a chance to thank you for what you did. Sacrificing your identity for my safety. But... Uh, it was a dangerous thing to do. You could lose everything. The uh, secrecy you've worked so hard to maintain. I did it for you. Gone. Without you, none of this would work. You are my family. You're the only one I have left, bro. You don't know how good it is to hear you say that. After everything that's happened. And your ear? At least there's something left of it. <laughs> and Dr. Tompkins assured me it adds character. <laughs> that what are we going to do about that, though? We will get through this, Bruce. Don't lose sight of the fact that you've done some real good for Gotham. You should be proud. Uh, Gotham is safer now. Gotham is safer now. I only hope the peace will last. It won't. We could all use some peace. To peace. And the to the piece of ear that I lost. The of Arkham has left Gotham a city in turmoil. Faith in those at the top has perhaps irrevocably been shaken. Acting Commissioner James Gordon has promised to speak out about the issue tonight during an emergency citywide address. And I hope, despite the recent Hell terror yeah. that's gripped our city, that Gotham's leading citizens will come out to show their support. Will his token appointment be enough to regain the city's trust? It remains to be seen. But experts agree that 
Gordon requested Gotham's leaders to stand behind him. Am I one? Leaders like you. Hell yeah. Let Gotham see who Bruce Wayne truly is. And let them know what you plan to do for his future. This could be a first start. Could be. For you and for this city. Though, in Gotham, the only figure that can make as much impact as a Wayne is Batman. You've helped this city tremendously, both as Bruce Wayne and Batman. And that person, whether he dons a cape or not, is someone I'm proud of and honored. Hell My yeah! Friend. Uh, that's a, li a lot to live up. Now, you know what? Thank you. Thank you. That's an ugly smile, bro. <laughs> so, what do you intend to do about tonight? Well, Lucius has yet to invent a suit that'll let Bruce Wayne and Batman be in the same place at once. That is unfortunate. So I have to go as one or the other? I suppose you must decide whose appearance will be more valuable. As Honestly, Bruce, you can help repair the damage done to your name, get the public support so that you can change things from the top down. But Batman is a symbol of justice and strength. Maybe in these dark times, that is truly what Gotham needs the most. No, I, it makes more sense to go as Bruce. Perhaps one is truly what you know. Bruce Wayne will be there. You'll make quite the impression. Gordon will be grateful. I don't see how Batman would be the right one. Bruce Wayne makes more sense. GCPD headquarters, 6.30 p.m. Commissioner Gordon. He is here. Hell yeah. Commissioner Gordon. That doesn't sound right. It does. More Don't right worry. than you know. It will. Thank you for having me, Commissioner. What uh, happened to your ear? <laughs> it's painful. Cut myself shaving. That... What'd you use? A chainsaw? <laughs> well, to be honest, I was surprised to get your call. Now, after that nasty business at your manor, I know Harvey was a good friend of yours. A loss like that, I wouldn't blame you for lying low. What you did is no secret. These people all saw there's more to Bruce Wayne than just the playboy. Public opinion is bound to swing around. Before long, you'll be Gotham's golden boy again. Uh, I'll show them the real Bruce Wayne. These people they have no idea who Bruce Wayne really is. But that's about to change. Oh? Well, I look forward to knowing the real Bruce Wayne as well. <laughs> I was half hoping Batman might show up, too. That wouldn't make sense, bro. I wouldn't mind knowing he was keeping an eye on things here. I'd, uh... Not to mention... I'd like to meet him. <laughs> Makes one hell of an impression on people. Well, too bad he's not here. Wouldn't mind meeting him. Yeah? Huh. Well, he's not much of a talker. <laughs> I'm ready for you, Commissioner. Oh, I'm so happy for him. Now, during times like these, even under the circumstances, it can feel impossible to hold on to hope. But I have hope. Hope that together we can rebuild what was lost. Now, in the last few weeks, as much violence and terror as I've seen, I've also seen the citizens of this community band together to fight those threats. And one of those people is Bruce Wayne. Damn straight! Thank you, Commissioner Gordon. Tough act to follow. <laughs> <clears throat> How the hell's that funny? <laughs> I'm here today to not only show my support for our acting commissioner, but also for this city. Many of you have suffered terrible losses. And some of those losses came at the hands of my own father, or at least as a result of his actions. Uh, no excuses for I my father. My father, but nothing can excuse what he did. So today, I stand before you as my own man. 
heir not to the Wayne legacy, but to Gotham's. If my recent incident with Harvey Dent has shown me anything, it's that I can no longer sit on the sidelines. My family's wealth was built on the suffering of others. I think it's time to repay that debt. I plan to use my resources to improve the city and make the lives of its citizens better. Good for you, Bruce. And to that end. Uh... A, uh, a better Arkham Asylum. I am ceasing construction on the Wayne Mental Health Facility. Instead, I'll be devoting all my resources to improving the existing Arkham Asylum. It will be the most advanced mental health treatment facility in the country, in keeping with the vision of its founders. Good. I feel like we need more uh, mental health protection. Oh god. Run! Who's this? Oh, snap! Is that. She's gonna recognize him. Clear the area! Get that bastard to lock up! She didn't recognize him. Good. That was crazy. Just. Minutes ago, Bruce Wayne delivered a rousing speech that turned into a shocking assassination attempt on his life. Oh, crap, he escaped? Oh, snap, dude! <laughs> Don't tell me season two is about him. Damn. All right, let's check out. Uh, what did you do about Harvey's coin? 55%. This one was... It could have gone either way. I understand that this is how, how close this is. I kind of was tempted to just throw it as well instead of putting it in my pocket, but... Yeah, I guess this makes sense. All right, let's see what's next. Uh, did you blame Alfred for his involvement with Thomas Wayne? You and 27% of... Only 27%? It didn't matter whose fault it was. So 67% players conforted? Uh, sure, why not? Alfred, the, he wasn't to blame. Oh, I mean, I guess that makes sense. All right, let's see. How did you respond to Selena? 91% of players uh, said that she was more than a thief. This does not surprise me in the slightest, to be honest. Did you take off the cowl? 73% people did. That's surprising. Actually, that one kind kind of catches me off guard. I figured a lot of people would still protect uh, Batman's identity. But, I mean, it is Alfred. So I guess there is a little bit more to think about in that sense. Uh, did you attend Gordon's address as Bruce or as Batman? 61% of people went in as Bruce. So that's cool. That's nice. I like that. Um, I mean, overall, do, none of this really surprised me. I'm kind of happy that a lot of my decisions are some of the decisions that most people chose. So that's good. This chapter was absolutely insane. That final battle with uh, Vicky was absolutely wonderful man it was so intense so good we got our ass beat we have no ear and vicky is dead <laughs> it's crazy dude but i enjoyed this whole entire season dude i can't wait to start season two but you're gonna have to wait for that just a little bit so if you enjoyed this video though or this series or this entire season do me a huge favor, drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed, because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next one. Deuces.